Hey, it's Mike. Let's talk about Reaper. Today I'd like to talk to you about navigating markers in your projects. Let's take a look. Now by default in Reaper, you can use the number keys at the top of your keyboard to navigate from markers 1 through 10. Just by pressing them, you can see here I'm at marker 1. I'll press number 4 on my keyboard and the playhead has moved to marker number 4. This works fine for markers 1 through 10 with 0 being the key press for marker number 10. But what do you do if you've got markers beyond number 10? I recently discovered another shortcut that allows you to quickly jump to specific times, markers, or regions by name or number. Let's check it out. The dialog is accessed by pressing Ctrl J on the keyboard. So I can either go to a marker by name or number or a region by name or number. If I'd like to go to a marker number that's higher than 10, I can start my query with the letter M for marker. And I'd like to go to marker number 11, so I'll type in 11. And I can either hit Enter on my keyboard or press OK in the dialog and the playhead has quickly jumped to marker number 11. Let's say I'd like to go to region 7, which is the intro for the bridge. I can follow the same process by pressing Control J to bring up the dialog, typing R for region, and I can either type the number 7 to go to region 7, or if I would like to go to bridge A, I could try the same process again by prefacing with R for region and typing bridge A by name, and it goes to region number 8, which is bridge A. This gives me plenty of options for navigating project markers, regions, and more. I hope this helps. If you like the content you're seeing, be sure to like, share, and subscribe. And you can support the channel by clicking on the Buy Me A Coffee link below. Also, the music in this video is from Batterhum, which is a punk band that I play drums for. Be sure to check out the links in the description for music videos, streams, and more. Oh, and before I forget, I like coffee.